in India prevails the storytelling culture. Also, stories connect us to the literature. If you are really interested in hearing stories, I, Chandrasekhar Pahimam, bring before you a short story, which is actually a real incident of my life, which gave me a lesson. Storytelling is an art. Concentrate on the intonation and stress used by me. The story begins. I was standing in front of the mall wiping off my car. I had just come out from the car wash and was waiting for my wife to get out of work. Coming my way from across the parking lot was a beggar. From the looks of him, he had no car, no home, no clean clothes and no money. There are times when you feel generous. But there are other times that you just don't want to be bothered. This was one of those don't want to be bothered times. I hope he doesn't ask me for any help, I thought. He didn't. He came and sat on the pavement in front of the bus stop. But he didn't look like he could have enough money to even ride the bus. After a few minutes, he spoke. That's a very pretty car, he said. He was ragged, but he had an air of dignity around him. I said, thanks. Continued wiping off my car. He sat there quietly as I worked. The expected plea for money never came. As the silence between us widened, something inside me said, ask him if he needs any help. I was sure he would say yes, but I held true to the inner voice. Do you need any help? I asked. He answered in three simple but profound words that I shall never forget. We often look for wisdom in great men and women. We expect it from those of higher learning and accomplishments. I expected nothing but an outstretched creamy hand. He spoke the three words that shook me. Don't we all? He said. I was feeling high and mighty, successful and important above a beggar in the street. And those three words hit me like a 12 gauge shotgun. I needed help. Maybe not for bus fare or for a place to sleep, but I needed help. I reached in my wallet and gave him not only enough for the bus fare, but enough to get a meal and shelter for the day. Those three words still ring true. No matter how much you have, no matter how much you have accomplished, you need help too. You are not God. Now, no matter how little you have, no matter how loaded you are with problems, even without money or a place to sleep, you can give help. You never know when you may see someone that appears to have it all. They are waiting on you to give them what they don't have. This is to be realized. Now, maybe the man was just a homeless stranger wandering the streets. Maybe he was more than that. Maybe he was sent by a power that is great and wise to minister to the souls too comfortable in themselves. Well, that was an astounding incident and it gave me a lesson. And the lesson is always help everyone around you and never boast at all. Thank you very much for your patient listening.